If you saw a couple of my videos ago, I was using a ray cast to kind of determine what object was in front of me when I was shooting at ships or alien ships or objects in the distance. And one of the problems I had when I came to kind of this location that you can see here in Unity is that these little balls, I actually like wasn't aiming at very well. I was aiming like past them and I needed to aim in a different direction in order to actually hit them up or down. And I was able to solve that today with a little bit of help. So I wanted to show you how I did that here in the code. Now, the original code I had was to use that distance in, in the far distance of the game to point my cursor at, right? So my cursor moves around, it points at the distance and it shoots at that distance. The problem is if that distance is so far away, you start to lose that angular, uh, you know, I guess accuracy, right? The further it goes out and I'll show you what that looks like. But that's how I did it here is it was a vector three saying, take that target point position, you know, use the X and Y coordinates of my cursor, but send it out way in the distance. And then of course, when you hit something, that's when we use that screen to world point position, and then you you blow it up. But what I changed that to is I used a ray cast hit. And there was somebody in the comments that mentioned this is a better way to do it. So I have, uh, I created a variable and I said that variable is based on the mouse, mouse position for the screen point to ray. So where I'm at versus where it should be. And then I gave it two distances. I said, okay, if there is something in front of that position in the distance, I want you to aim at that. But if there's nothing in front of that distance, then the, the range or where you should shoot at is way out in that target distance. So let me show you what that looks like here in Unity because it's very revealing. You can see I have these kind of, you know, five objects now that I'm aiming at. And it's more revealing when I go over to the scene view because you can see when I point at any one object, I have these two, I have this yellow laser, which points directly at it. And I have the red one. And if I go off of that red one, if I go off of the target, I mean, you'll see the red kind of ray cast will, will immediately go down because it's shooting at that distance instead of shooting right at the target. So I'll do that a couple more times so you could see that red laser and that yellow laser. So the yellow laser stays pretty consistent. That's the ray cast. The red one is saying, hey, I want to shoot at the distance, which you could see I'd clearly miss it. And then it lines up with that ray cast when it finally sees that there's an object in front of it. So that's super cool to learn and obviously super relevant. I hope it helps you out today. That's what I was working on just to make this game a little bit better, a little more realistic and to hit those targets. I'll see you tomorrow.